Hey, Melanation Gang. Wish pop, wish pop, wish pop. Y'all, you know, it's your girl, the newbie, the number back with another one. All right. And, y'all, yeah, I already got like a kind of like a pre pull. That's why I got the camera kind of offset tonight because last night I thought I was going to redo a, another reading, but the computer started acting doing some weird shit. I thought this was really going to be a masculine reading, but it turned out to be a karmic reading. All right. And I got like a couple of different decks, a couple of things out here. Um, yeah, so we're gonna tap right deep back in. Um, if you are new to the channel, new to the channel, you already know what it is. Go ahead and tap those buttons you need to be tapping because that's not what it is, doing, all right? Because you know you're gonna love it here. And if you don't know, I know that you're gonna love it here. So you might as well just tap it. Um, I sing a little bit, I smoke a little bit, you know what I'm saying? I curse a little bit, but it's all good, it's all out of love. Yeah, be on point. So, today's date is, is 9.37 on the Klisna, 33% on the um, battery, and it's Tuesday, October 22nd. I could love them double numbers. I don't know about phone. I got two phones here, right? Yes, I know. It's cracked. Okay. Um, anywho. We're going to say the prayer because, like, I just got, like, a mouthful tonight, and I don't want to forget to say the prayer. Are you dealing with this karma gas energy? So, yeah, we got to get you. God grant us the serenity of the things that we can not change, the courage to change the things that we can't, and the wisdom to know the difference. I say, God grant us the serenity of the things that we can not change, the courage to change the things that we can't, and the wisdom to know the difference. Ashe, Ashe, Ashe. Anybody sending us any evil eye, please return that shit back to sender with intent of not so that they can stop doing that shit. I said, anybody sending me in my collective any evil eye, please return that shit back to sender with intent of not so that they can stop doing that shit. Ashe, 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 yeah. Anybody mocking us, please return our energy back to us a hundred fold. Anybody mocking us, please return our energy back to us a hundred fold. Ashe, 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 yeah. But yeah, you all. Yeah. It was my fault. <laughs> so the songs I was getting, um, I was getting songs all last night. Kept, they kept playing all day today. So, um. I was getting H Town. There's a thin line between love and hate. Okay. And I also was getting H Town. Emotions make you cry sometimes. Emotions make you lie sometimes. <laughs> emotions make you. <laughs> but most of all, emotions make you fall in love. Okay. But. Last but not least, the main character to this song of the night is going to be this, um, I think her name is Yiba. If I'm saying it wrong, okay, I'm sorry. It's Yiba, my mind. Let me tell you, it's my shit. Okay, it's my shit. And I think it just kept coming up. And now that I'm looking at these cards and I'm listening to the lyrics, I'm like, yeah, this is a karmic that is in their masculine energy. And this could be a karmic man. Take how it resonate on the screen right now. We got Jasmine Sinova and her girl like me. You gonna make a home out of me? He's like she was like you make me so insecure, and I don't even know what for. But you gonna make a home out of me? <laughs> He was like, you just needed something different. Tell me why is it some something? But you gon' gonna make up out of me, okay? Jasmine Sava and her girl like me. Yeah, that's my pick coming on last night too. 
But we're going to get back into this Yiba song. Men yelling outside. Y'all could have been um, arguing or something over the weekend. <clears throat> 9 41 on the clock. Again, Tuesday, October 22nd. Yiba, my mind. I heard you not come into quarter to three. You closed the door and lay next to me. But then I heard her, but I heard you, uh, but I heard you say, uh, I can't even get out. They don't want me to see. <laughs> oh my God. Okay, it says, I heard you not come into a quarter to three. You closed the door and lay next to me. And lay down next to me. But then I heard you say her name in your sleep. Your dirty secret is too far to keep. Hi, I'm about to lose my mind. <laughs> my hey, my I'm about to lose my my, my. Okay, y'all. She's like, you can't even look me dead in the eyes. She said, her love's so strong, she got you hypnotized. You say you love me, but I know it's a lie. <laughs> when I work so hard to keep you satisfied. Okay, she said, hi. <laughs> hi, hi. hi. Okay, she said, how could you do this to me? No way, no way. She can't take you <laughs> from me. She said, I sure won't stay, but I'll be damned if I ever leave. She said, anybody know what I'm talking about? As in like, yeah, she might fall back, but she ain't leaving. She can know she's going to sit far. So the sex is trying to get yik, still trying to like something. She's going to be... And then it was crazy when I just seen the flying here. Like, whoever keeps sending these modern ass spirits to my house, listen, baby, I am rebuking that shit and sending it back a honey fucking fold. Like, for real. Like, you're going to be, you're going to have to call a fucking exterminator for the with me. Like, stop playing in my fucking energy. Like, whoever it is, whether you watch my channel or not, I don't fuck it up. Weird. Because there's nothing in my house for no fucking fly to be here. That should be the weirdest shit. Especially when I know I done killed the damn fly. All right. Anywho. So, last night when it came out, it was the... Okay, it was the Two of Swords, the Emperor, and the Three of Swords in reverse. Like, and then I, when I seen that, she was like, no way, no way. She can't take you away from me, but I be damned. Um, she was like, she's like, I sure won't say, but I'd be damned if I leave. Like, this person that made up their mind that, or been going back and forth in their mind, like, what they gonna do. Like, on that, don't ask a man about a woman unless you ready to do something about it. Like, what you gonna do about it? Like, type shit is what I'm hearing. But also, it's like, whoever this is, they've been dealing with this person for a long ass time. So she like, because I'm hearing Beyonce. Uh, uh, I done been here too long, but I'll be damned if I see another chick on your arm. Don't you ring the alarm. And I'm hearing the whole, like, Lemonade album. Like, motherfuckers' potions and shit. <laughs> like, y'all crazy. And then the, the fucking I Hate You card came out. Right before I was about to come on here. And then it closed me out. So I, that's where I was getting that, um... I knew for sure to take that H town. It's a thin line between love and hate. Because I love you. It's on the other side. Like, what the fuck? And then, right after that, the very soon, oh, excuse me, spiritual birthday, and calling in your same came in reverse. Like, that's how I said. This is a karmic energy. Like, whoever this person is, they're not no soulmate to this person. And nothing is happening very soon with them. Like, if anything, they're getting left. Jasmine Sullivan on the screen again. What is this? Pick up your feelings. Okay. Okay. 
for you me to go me pick up your good feelings don't leave no pieces hey boy please hey i don't need you uh -oh. all the lies you can keep it you need to hurry and pick up your good feelings while i'm up cleaning hey. But a lot of my heart, but that's what's worse. See, I done made my peace so you can run those streets. Okay. Yeah. I sure won't stay, but I'll be damned if I leave. Listen. And then that, this one card, keep, it keeps getting up on top. I don't know how the fuck this shit keeps getting up on top, but it came on the reverse this time. This one says conditional love. So for the divine feminine, he has unconditional love because that this card kept coming out like in the last three readings. But for whatever reason, it's karmically, and it came out conditional love. It says apples and oranges, like somebody was just selling somebody's a placeholder. Like this is placeholder energy. This karmic is finding out she's placeholder energy. They're apples and oranges. They're not two birds of feather that flock together. I'm here. I hate you so much right now, Khalees. I hate you so much right now. Ah. And then it says on the way, pregnancy at play. Like somebody could be lying and saying that they're pregnant, got a pregnancy scare. They like, man, I don't know what you do this line. You know, for the pregnant or whoever the divine feminine is. Is like that's the pregnancy scare or something like that, the pregnancy at play, and that's why this camera know that they're getting left. And she like, um, I sure won't stay, but I'd be damn if I leave. Like, the fuck, like y'all not even just me out the picture. Like, like somebody's not accepting the fact that they ain't it, <laughs> and it's exactly how it came out. It came out just like that on top of the deck, and then I under his job. I'm hungry, Mimi. On my lunch break, don't wear no panties. Just stick to basics, okay? Great minds think alike. Okay, so again, he like to stick to the basics, just play your role. Um, I'm here, quickies. Like, this person, like, this masculine doesn't make love to this karmic energy or placeholder energy. Like, they do cookies and stuff. But, like, with you, y'all, I'm hearing that like, y'all make love. I'm here. I want to make love, love, love. And then I'm hearing, I think I'm in love again. Mm -mm. Andre 3000. I think you might be the one. Hey. It, Cause if not, <laughs> you are the prototype. Yeah, that's what that shit is. Yeah. I think that we could see the sun. Yeah, so this girl comes to this man's job like, yeah, he don't even like, whatever it is, it's a quickie. It's a quickie. It's not no passion or nothing. Yeah, smoke and mirrors. Orgies. What the fuck? He buys it, my little bitch, S&M. What? It's better natural than dead up uh, smoke and mirrors. So yeah, whatever this is, is smoke and mirrors with this person. Like they think they doing something with the sexual encounter, but it's really not even what they think it is. Jasmine Sullivan in love with another man. Yeah, this this man is in love with another woman. Like they not even in love with that person. I hope y'all could really hear me. Oh my God. Yeah. S and M and Orgies. It's like how you think this man is taking you serious and y'all over there having orgies and stuff. Like making the airplane going over. Like he leaving, he dipping out, he going to his empress. 
And she mad. Oh, mommy, don't do it like that once more. Hug your friends. Who is it? What's my name? <laughs> so he could call this divine feminine mommy or something like that. So this feminine, like this karmic energy, placeholder energy is mad because like they don't call them nothing like that or the names they used to call them, they call you now. Or you like you have like a whole nother energy or vibe. So like names they call you, they would never call them like type of thing. It's something with a name calling thing. I don't know. And then on these lover cards, yeah. Soulmate came out in reverse. That's how I knew it was a karmic reading. And with this three of swords, like I fucking talking to a motherfucker ain't nobody. Fucking no more. It's like the energy is getting. It's like a lost connection. Like, I'm fucking saying they doing shit and ain't. It's not adding up. Okay, like somebody's trying to like juke their way through the situation or something. Yeah, for the weekend on the weekend, SZA. Somebody's just a weekend girl. Pillow talking. They could be pillow talking about you. Um, divine feminine or something. That this could be one of their spies. Like, little do you know, like this this placeholder energy could be spying on divine feminine and running back telling a masculine or something like that in a weird way. Let the best woman win. Yeah, falling back. This karma says she falling back. She can't compete. He already knows she for the weekend. Or if he had his choice, he is going to pick you every time. And especially, like, she knows she got this conditional love, and it's a pregnancy at play. Nine times out of ten with fi divine feminine. Crazy. Oh, into the G. And then I got the last two that was on top of the lover's cards was Hella family issues in reverse. And it said let go of control issues in reverse. So, yeah, somebody is very controlling. And somebody don't want to heal their um, childhood trauma, I'm hearing. Somebody don't want to heal their childhood trauma. Yeah, and it, and it causes a person to have control issues and it, that they don't want to let go of. That, and that's another reason why I'm not going to want to leave. Period. All right, we're gonna get some more information. Um, let me. I'm gonna pause this real quick so I can make sure I have enough room and we don't get timed out. So hold on one second. All right, I deleted like at least one video. So yeah, this is crazy, y'all. I want to get to the meat and potatoes. <laughs> what else is going on in this karmic connection? What's that? What else is going on in this karmic connection spirit? Homebody. For the streets. Yeah, this mask is leaving because this divine feminine is a homebody. The other chick is for the streets. Somebody could try to be saying that she was for the streets. And even when um you it like was, it's like you might go out, you have fun, but you know who you get your body to and who you don't. This feminine on the other hand probably got caught red-handed with so many times that I'm hearing like air fishy smell or something. Fishy talking about like BV or something. Like it's a constant thing with BV or something or some type of pH imbalance because this person is sleeping with too many people. Like it's never fresh. And then I'm the um Alicia Keys, this kept coming on last night too. Fire um fire we make. It's getting higher and higher, high from the love we make. I can't stay away. Oh 
Oh, yeah, homebody. And somebody like, like it's comfy, it's cozy over there. I'm hearing um, it's clean, refrigerator busting, and the Wi-Fi busting, and the Gucci busting, everything busting. <laughs> busting. Okay. What you doing with all that? Let me touch it. Hey, she says, my swap. Yay. What else is going on in this karmic connection? Why is this karmic mad? Damn. Overbird narc. She's an overbird narcissist. And she's she's demasculating. He don't like her because she's an overbird narc and she's demasculating. She don't ever stimulate him. Nothing. Like she just ugh. He felt like he do it to her. He want to have protected sex. <laughs> With you, he don't have to worry about none of that. Or he be asking her, like, do you even be protecting yourself when you be out here? Somebody could have an abortion. Or in this history, it's like somebody mad because they either had an abortion or a miscarriage. And now you it's just your turn to have a baby divine feminine and you're going to be going full term with this baby so they're going to be sitting there like damn they wish they never miscarried or had an abortion when it was their turn because i feel like they could have fucked with this person for a minute that's for like a small feel y'all if that resonates and somebody is like really really deep deep in thought about them and the way she said in that song she said you didn't come into the quarter to three she said, you lock the door and you lie next to me. But I heard you say her name in your sleep. She's like, your dirty lies are too on. Oh, way too um, far gone to keep. Ah, yeah, lies. A fucking liar. A fucking monty. A super monty. Okay. Somebody like the fact like this divine feminine don't lie. Even if it hurt feelings, she ain't gonna lie. And then I got male carrier, female carrier on his side. Oh, that must be what that's for. And it's raining outside like a motherfucker. Because at the bottom of this deck, so that was sticking out to me too and I forgot to take it. It was the eight of fucking wands. Like, Okay, so it could be some, like I said, it's gossip going around, but it's in the reverse. So that's what it got to do with that pillow talking, because pillow talking came out in reverse. So somebody is pillow talking. Y'all see that? This male and this female is sitting up talking. And they like, I hate you. And they like, well, shit, it is what it is. It is what it is, buttercup. Buttercup, yeah. So I ain't mad that they not working on this connection. I'm here for Ness two times. He was like, what he say? I was clutching on my Glock when I went to go meet my daughter. She was like, um, Ricky, you something. He was like, shut up. He was like, I'll off you in them niggas. <laughs> It was, I think it's been that some time in the T Grizzly. I forgot what the name of the song is called. But yeah, that's how I'm feeling with this. Like, somebody mad, like, they ain't pouring into the connection or something. Like, how they expect it. But to this other person, they not lying. It's like they take whatever this karmic say to them, observe they self, and then come back and ask you to see what you're going to say, and you don't lie. And this mask is trying to make it seem like they're going to start, like, I don't know, like, it's something weird. Can you tell me more about this seven of cups, I mean, not seven of pentacles in reverse? Hangman in reverse. Knights in reverse. I mean, Knight of Swords in reverse. Yeah, Knight of Pentacles reverse. Like I said, this person's not putting no more effort into this relationship. 
And that's what this placeholder is mad about. And they're like, why are you sitting up here talking to me about her? And nothing is never a lie. <laughs> Jack Ross, So Into You, featuring D-Nice. I don't know this song, probably. Do I? I don't know, but it's playing in the background. I don't know that song, so y'all have to go look that up. It is Jack Ross, J-A-C, Ross, R-O-S-S, -S, So Into You, featuring D-Nice. All right. So, what is going on with these lies in reverse? What is the conversation, these lies in reverse and these rumors. This, this pillow talking, like I said. Justice. Yeah, motherfucker trying to figure out the truth so they can get the justice. Like I said, somebody is taking the information that a motherfucker is telling them, putting two and two together, and coming and come get. And it's all adding up. Ain't no lies. So, whatever the rumors is, is going to get laid to rest. And this kind of like she gonna get stabbed in the back, but it's not really like you got stabbed in the back because you was a willing participant. And all this masculine is not gonna pay you. And maybe she ran too, like she know her lifestyle about to change, probably about to start having to hold on to her budget a little bit more. Okay? Something with the, her budget or something. But, and then I'm with this too. It's like, a motherfucker not going to give up. It's like, I like said, I sure won't stay, but I'll be damn if I leave. Okay. She said, like, I think about it all the time. You'll always be mine. Yeah. Oh, hell no. How is this masculine feeling about this karmic? He wants to. <laughs> Look, I can't make this shit up. He is looking everywhere but her. She was like, you can't even look me dead in the eye. Her love so good, she got you hypnotized. Yeah, like a motherfucker is turning down fucking cups. They don't want that cup. The karmic fucking got it. Like, bitch, the fuck out of here. But they just settling for it until they like, mm. because I'm hearing feminine, divine feminine is a baddie. And it's a lot of judgment. I'm hearing baddies post for me. She was like, ass fat, slim ways, no tummy. Hey. <laughs> Catalina. Okay, yeah, that could be a lot of gossip too. Like, the right women could be like just a, a limelight or like a social butterfly, popular loner. Like, she the empress. Like, she don't got too many friends. It's like, it's always going to be gossip on her. She's the Marilyn Monroe. She's the Aaliyah. She's the motherfucking, um, what's that little girl? Um, Johnny Bonet. Um, Shirley Temple. Um, What's her name too? The original Betty Boop. Um, 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 um. The black lady from back in the day. I can't remember her name. I'm seeing her face. Um, uh, she did the stand-up comedy and dance and all of that. Coco. I see you. Yeah, Coco Jones. It's something about your hands on my body. Feels better than any man I ever met. Something about the way you just feel me. Trying not, uh uh, can't forget you. Got a thing with a soul that I need in my life. Back. Okay. And though we were grown, oh no, how we don't grow up for that. Maybe I need 
at you. I see you. I put my heart on you. Yeah, like this divine feminine, she's a bad, like she's on her shit, like. <clears throat> And she's like, okay, you know, I want my stuff and stuff like that. Like, and all these people want me stuff like that. Like, I want this masculine, but it's like this masculine, like, I don't know. You know what I'm saying? Or this man could be like, shit, should I just stay here with this placeholder? Or should I go after my divine feminine? Even though, you know, she got all of this stuff going on that I might not got going on. Yeah. Page of Swords. Like, somebody don't know how to express that. That could be the judgment or something. That could be the conversation that's coming in. All right. What does the masculine, what else does this masculine want to say to the karmic? What else does this masculine want to say to the karmic? Yeah, they walking away. See? <laughs> See? Then came, I don't know how many times. Yeah, he's leaving you for his lover. <laughs> Dog, this masculine is not playing. He is straight to the point. Straight to the fucking point. Okay. What does the karmic want to say about this? What does the karmic say about this masculine leaving for his lover? She wants to demasculate him. Or now she, like, or no, she like instead of trying to emasculate him and try to like always be in this uh energy, now she wants to try to pour in and e emasculate him. Now she wants to be more lively in the relationship and he's like, No, because I know that's not even really your energy. I don't even fuck with you like that. Like I fuck with you, but I don't fuck with you like that. Damn, it's too late, Buttercup. Sorry. You got played. You got played. Yeah, you got played. He's not pouring into this relationship because he about to pour into his son. Having this son with this empress. I said what else is going on. And that's what they said. He not pouring into the situation because he has to pour into his son. We already had the seven of pentacles come in reverse. What does the empress have to say about all of this? Is it empress? <laughs> the empress over there playing stupid. <laughs> The Empress, like, that ain't got nothing to do with me, honey. Like, uh-uh, uh-uh, uh-uh. Nope. Because I ain't about to even lie. Like, you come ask me something, I'm telling you straight up. So, I ain't about to be even going through all of that type of dumb ass shit. Like, so you come over, yeah, 30, 33, 13 was just on my clock. So, if you want to come over and fuck with me, you will have to be honest, too. Because we not going through none of that. Like, even if it hurt each other's feelings, like, we going to tell the truth. Fuck that. 33, um, 23 was just on the clock. What else does this empress want to say about this situation? <laughs> yeah. It was the wands in reverse. Oh, empress in reverse. She like, huh? This empress like, I don't know. She kind of iffy too. Like, Or she over here playing stupid because she's like, right now, I'm just pregnant. I'm chilling, laid back in the cut. I ain't got time to be fighting, arguing with nobody because I seen the um, King of Wands in reverse. Like, this Empress, like, I ain't going for none of that. What else does this Empress want to say? So, knee har it if you let me. If you let me. If you let me. Five of Swords did come on top of the deck. But, yeah, you, like, this Empress don't want to fight. If you let her teach you how not to fight, yeah. This Empress, like, I'm not into third-party shit. Don't put me in that. Don't put me in that. She said, don't put me in that shit. Don't put me in them fights. 
I love you like you never ever let somebody. I give you things you never even knew you wanted. Don't tell me that it's not enough. Get over us. Our time is up. Cause I've been thinking about you too. Anything for you. If you just let me. If you just let me. Yeah. Queen of Wands in reverse. They don't want to argue. They trying to build a foundation. That is it. That is all. And especially why this person pregnant. Like, I'm not about to be doing all that and they keep closing me out. She she done said her piece. Like, if it ain't got nothing to do with my <laughs> stability or adding to it, I don't have shit to do with that. Well, damn. Hmm. Let's see where some of y'all are from. We at 3550. Where are y'all from? I don't even know what I'm trying to do. So let me start. Oh, there we go. There it goes. Where is some of my collector from that is going through this? Where is some of my collector from that is going through this? Where is my, some of my collector from that is going through this? You don't have to have, have to be from here, but you can be surrounding these states, cities, or originally from there or something. Virginia, Richmond. Wyoming. Three, oh, yeah, Virginia is 804. Wyoming, 307. Cheyenne. Chicago, Illinois, 773. 410, Maryland, Indianapolis. Where else is some of my collector from that is going through this? Where is some of my collector from that is going through this? Narqua, Monaco. Where is some of my collector from that is going through this? North Dakota, Bismarck, 701. Oh, Silver Spoon Shelter. If there's a will, there's a way. Okay, so <laughs> when this empress have this baby, that baby gonna have a silver spoon where there's a will, there's a way. Belize, Bell, Ma Bell, Mopan, New Mexico, Santa Fe, 505. All right. You can also take those zip codes and use them as angel numbers. All right, you guys. Until I get the editing up for you guys. And I'm also getting Dominican Republic. Santo Domingo and Kansas Topeka, seven eight five. And outside point is fifty cent. Twenty one questions. Would you still love me if I ain't smells? If you still hug me if I got locked up in the quarter century? Would you support me mentally? Would you poop and disappear? Or some of my friends they playing it outside. I'm not playing that. Would you be down the ride? Okay, yeah. But I think that was enough confirmation. But I know y'all like when I call out the job, so let's be loving nosier. Where do some of the people work at? <laughs> Where do some of the people that work at that is dealing with this? Okay, so y'all might get a little bit more messages like this. LMA close. Hand sanitizer. Health code violation, HIPAA laws in effect. Okay, so somebody lit, um, worked somewhere in the health field or something or just had a recent health violation or some type of code of conduct violation. Where else do some of my people work at? Where else do some of my people work at? Upgrade. Loyal customers always get a credit on their account, cell phone, phone number change. Okay, somebody can work at a phone store. And things to make me smile. I treat you how you want to be treated. Just teach me how. You're not in our records. It's like you're a ghost. Okay. Some of y'all is like ghosts around this motherfucker. Y'all really don't fuck around with certain shit. Or y'all don't file taxes or something. Like y'all thugging in them streets real hard. Okay. <laughs> I am a kept woman housewife of. Okay. So 
One of y'all could be like um housewife energy of one of these states I called out. All right. Take it how it resonates. Like I said, the baby gonna be sheltered, silver spoon in its mouth. Um alimony. I'll be proud to pay. Get the fuck on. Okay, so yeah. And even if this person is married to somebody, somebody like, I'm proud to pay that alimony. I don't care. Get the fuck on. I think you need to leave. Leave me alone. Alone. Take your back. Hey, get the hell on. Cause I don't want you no more. Hey. Private. More tips and gifts for me. Landscape company. Okay, so somebody could have a private landscape company or something like that. Construction landscape. Nonprofit association. Somebody could work for a nonprofit. And I'm also seeing food trucks that street food be hitting better than the fast food. Okay, so somebody is real good. Culinary arts and has a, a truck or something like that and do truck food. That's what's up. So y'all be getting to the money. Hey, everybody. <laughs> but y'all, y'all already know if you say it to the end, thank you, thank you, thank you for the one and which is on my clock. Um, you already know it's Mel Nation, Mel Game, Mel Pop, Mel Taking Over, period. Duh. And if you haven't already, like I said in the beginning, smash those buttons you need to be smashing so we can twerkulate, percolate, and grow. And you already know I love my kings, my queens, my loves, and my babies. Gracias and chao.